You can do this, buddy. Shit, there's two of them. Don't go out there yet. Come on then. Gaming Grunyards were back on day 12, Operation 12 of Zitadel, a hardcore, hard uh, conquest campaign where we're playing the Germans and we have the AI for combat set at hardcore and we have the economy set on hard. So we're, we've been fighting our way across this map, we've been getting uh, victories and defeats, we're now on the defensive again, so I've reconfigured my forces. As you might expect, phase one, we've got a lot of engineers and miners to get us dug in and get us settled. Uh, phase two, we're bringing in one of the 85 millimeter. I kept referring to them as 88s in the last game, but they're 85 millimeter captured uh, Russian anti-aircraft guns. They, they perform a similar role to the 88. Um, phase three, Panzer IV coming in for get some mobile anti-infantry firepower. 20 points but we're going to go for it and then phase four uh, and and another 85 coming in with more supply and then phase four our captured kv and that 120 millimeter mortar it's a lot of points for the mortar but uh we're on the defensive and we need that we've also got uh in our back pocket uh two medium um mortar barrages and two medium artillery barrages so we're going to see what we're going to do to hold these guys off uh, cons my concern my concern in this is that russian tank development is now outstripping ours we've seen kvs already and if we've seen kv1s we might see kv2s and we don't have anything serious in the way of anti-tank defenses other than the the guns but close anti-tank we've just got flamers um and i'm just I'm, I'm I'm struggling a little bit here. We've only got one medic. We've got a pioneer squad there that gives us flamers. We've got two supply trucks. We've got a two one, yeah, two supply trucks to move things around quickly, and one flamer. I'm 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 I've got to go with it. I'm going to go with it. I can't keep uh, chopping and changing. In this game, you have to commit and stick with your commitment. So let's go. Select a mission. It's a research point mission, which is good for us. It's two stars. Let's just take that one and go. Okay, so we know this map. We've seen this map before. This is dense forest and um, installations, uh, industrial installations. There's some dug in uh, territory. The, the ground's pretty good for miners and anti-tank mines because the roads through the forest are very limited and there's some big blocks of rocks so we should be able to create some blockages but our job here we're probably going to have three objectives now we're, we're in phase 12 of the campaign so we're going to hold two let one fall and then try and resist the counter attack that's the plan and that's what we're going to go for uh, did i mention my cat is here with me so if she starts kicking off then you'll know what that is it's not me squawking it's the cat Right, we've got three, two together, one far away. The answer's obvious. We're in the southwest corner. We'll let the sun come up. We're not going to do anything about that objective up in the northeast. It's way too far away. Let's just hit pause and go take a look. So going directly forward, we've got a hill. On top of that hill, there's one industrial complex that we can dig in and fortify around that. Trenches, we can block off these. this entrance here with between the buildings with tank traps we can block this off with tank traps or maybe a little bit higher that's fairly reasonable and our second it's not particularly defensible that can be approached from a lot of directions that's quite a tricky place to defend in fact i think the better defense of that one is not in it but behind it it's here in a line here and then we use uh, anti-personnel mines to flood that side of it around those tree lines so where else are we going to mine? 
well we're coming in directly southeast so we'd really like to mine up that area and maybe down this road a bit is there a junction that junction there looks like that's right for mines that junction there looks right for mines and then some more mines down in this complex here where we think the armor will push through into here we've got this nice dugout here so again this channel here between these two locations uh, is a perfect location for anti-tank mines and anti-personnel mines because the tanks will come down that road okay let's take pause off and get into this one so here's our call in one um, we want to mine out that junction there we want anti-personnel mines scattered around this objective here. Where's our other boys? Where are they? Let's get this truck forward. Yeah. This area here for anti-tank mines. A mortar. I like the mortar somewhere around here because I'm actually not going to active those rocks look like a nice place I'm not going to actively actively defend that objective I'm going to passively defend that objective so I want some guys really dug in well dug in with barbed wire and defenses around that so we're going to send these guys here to fortify this location uh, that truck there everyone moving everyone moving okay yeah they are let's get a call in too so calling two, pick up that 88. We'll, we're going to send. We'll just send those infantry there for now. This uh, a machine gun looks pretty good in the, that corner there, covering that road. This 88. Where's going to be a long line of fire? Uh, it's got to be somewhere around here. It's got to be somewhere around there. That's the miners. That's the engineers that are going to fortify that one. Everything's moving quite slowly. This is the first of the anti-personnel miners. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two. Let's get those those mines into place all around that. The other miners are moving forward. Uh, it's a quite a difficult call. I don't want those trees in the way. Let's put that down there. And then face it that way and dig it in. And dig it in there. What do we got here? We've got our two medics. So we need a medic station around there as well. Uh, infantry on the flank there we we'll just we'll just get you to dig in yourselves while we get the engineers to prepare you so one two three four one two three four five six seven eight nine you just get yourselves dug in there boys right you're on mining duty one two three four five six seven eight nine ten Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. You get that done. What we do? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, boy. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. You got there. Right, one of you boys get out of that, and the other one go up and top these fellows up with mines up there. In what kind of defences do we need here? Some anti-tank 
uh, defences there, stop the infantry getting into there. How are these miners doing? You're doing fine, you boys. Where is that base? That base is there, so we're running out of time here. This feels a bit precious. One trench there. Another trench there. You got any mines left? Another 12. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You guys, fill your boots and then back down that road. How are you doing for mines? You're doing, you've got another three. So it's just put another, that's my cat. One, two, three, just put those there. Get into there. You've got some mines as well. Just fill up with mines and then we'll bring them back down to the anti-personnel miners. You've got some you've got some we've got another call in we're running slow here we need to be running a bit hotter in terms of our defenses let's get a call in three that's another 88 uh, Panzer I'm just going to put over there and keep this 88 Right, we were going to mine up this gap here, weren't we? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Is what we're going to do there. You boys. Okay, you boys get into that trench there. You boys get into that trench there. And you two get out of there and fall back. Oh shit, they're coming from the other side. We've got it completely wrong. Oh boy. Oh boy, we've got a rebalancing out. So we need a trench here. And we need another trench here. And we need an 88 somewhere like here. Where's our other, where's our first 88? Not a bad position, it's okay. Let's bring that around there. We got this very wrong. One, two, put a couple of mines there. What have we got here? That's the mining truck. Just bring that back down here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Some mines there. We'll swing this tank over to here to rebalance what we're doing. We've got some infantry here in reserve. I just want them to hang out here. The medics. We'll put you over there. Wow, we don't get, we don't often get this so completely wrong, but sometimes we do. Okay, we've got a mortar here that's a little bit exposed. We've got a machine. We've got a machine gun that we want backing up these guys.
Okay. 88 is there. Just point it in that way. Hmm. Okay, so we've lost one of the objectives. Five more mines. One, two, three, four, five. Just put you there. This is going to be tough because we've now got to actually defend. one of these objectives with no defences this feels a bit like Custer's last stand, what can we do here? this 88 Getting lots, we're getting lots of activity with the mines. I'm going to put this KV up here. Lots of activity with the mines. Swing some infantry around here. Reserve crew here. Fuck! They're here! I would really like to get that guy back up. Right, get the crew over there. Bring the KV around the flank of these guys. Well, that's a strike. That, that was the machine gun, wasn't it? <sighs> okay, you're going to... What is happening here? Pants are forward to there. You boys. One. You boys. One, two, three, four, five. How is the other 88 doing? Just doing fine. Okay. 
Get out of that. Back you come. Get the ammo back with you. Bit further. F. Full on, full on, full on, full on. What is going on here? We're taking a lot of casualties in this area. Okay, let's get you guys to there. Get some smoke there. One, two, three. Do we need some more ammo for this? And you're not really doing much. Wow. Wow. Uh, we're going to start taking a ton of stuff. Where is that? Where is that? There's still one dead in there. Medic. Back you go. One more in that smoke. Come on. Right, you, KV, you need some infantry on your flank out there. Wow, most of you are dead. Didn't even see that happen. Got another heavy tank up there. Oh, God in heaven. Ammunition. Am ammunition. Ammunition. Mortar. Heavy mortar. Heavy mortar. Heavy mortar. Can we recap? That's a crew. Thank you. 
This is murderous. This is just murderous. What is that thing there? It's a KV-1. Okay, we need some reserve infantry into that location. And a medic on... Spread out. There, medic. Who are you? You're a flamethrower. You can come round here. How are you doing for ammo? You've only got. You have only got. Uh, get that thing repaired. I want that ammo on that truck now. Are we about to lose this? Do we need some cap weight? Right, you four infantry, I want capway inside this objective. Move back to there. F. F. Bloody hell. What have we got there? Can't even see it. Some kind of... Uh, who knows? Some smoke on him. To hell with it. Mortars there. How are you doing for ammo, my boys? Come on, medic, back there. You're doing a great job. Bloody hell. You crawl forward. You crawl forward. What is this? KV! And again! And again! Can't see me through the smoke. Oh. 
Do I have a flamethrower? Where do I have a flamethrower? You. Okay. Hero of the day. Hero of... Come on, man. Hero... Hero of the day. You can do this, buddy. Wo kommt der denn her? Shit, there's two of them. Don't go out there yet. Come on then. This one got you. Okay, we're out. Come on, the last one, the last one. We've got to smoke him. Track him out. Okay, that was a piece of heavy artillery. And that piece of heavy artillery is out here somewhere. Can somebody go? We got a flame. They've got, got a flamethrower here. Okay. Now we know where you are. What about this gun? Is that wrecked? That's wrecked. And we've got another one coming. I don't believe this. And another one. Come on, you're in his side. Come on, man. That's, that's got to hurt him. You're going to hit him in the side. Come on. Oh, come on, this is just not right. Side to front, side to front. Okay, somebody here has got to have a demo charge for your back deck.
that's got to get him out. Where's the medic? Where's the medic? Where is the medic? Wow. That's a bit... He can't still be moving. There's another one. How many fucking KVs have these guys got? Right. Get this. Pick this up. Put it, bring it round here. Come on, nail him. It's a KV-1. Oh God. This is just savage, brutal, terrible, medium artillery. It's going to condemn these guys to death, but that's what it's going to take. That's all I've got left in my arsenal. Stay back here, boys. Right, you have got a three kilogram satchel charge. And I want it on him. I want that satchel charge on him. That's got to have done him. That's got to have done him, yes. And it's done you as well. So what have we got left here? We've got another ruined 88. Okay, we've got a victory, but I so want the spoils of war. Have we destroyed everything? I just... 
have we got another engineer? We've got precious little. We've got a KV-2 is what we've got. You're going to run in there, mate. I might just have to call this. What, and what I'm really after here is that flamethrower. That's a medic. That's a crew member. Right, you're pretty expendable. Track out. We've only got HE. Okay, we've got the victory. We can call this at any point. Anti-tank rifle ain't going to do you much help, mate. Fucking hell. Okay, I've got one one last roll of the dice. One last roll of the dice before I call this game off. On the floor in here, if there's no Russian infantry, There's another tank. I don't believe it. Where is he? I'm looking the wrong way. It's over there. Fantastic. Hero. Absolute. Somebody keeps trying to get into this tank. You. Get the flamethrower on, on him. Never. 
Not nice. Get in that tank. No, don't get in that tank. Get. Yeah, why not get in that tank? Why not get in that tank? Right, we just got to recap this. Right, you've got sh Okay, our hero of the Soviet Union got killed. We got a medic. We got somebody bleeding out in here. Where is he? This guy? Get the medic to there. Basically, I've got nobody left, have I? But much as I would love to cap this equipment, I, I could just get into the tanks, couldn't I? That tank's going to come back with me. Can we repair that? No. Can we capture that KV? Yeah, if we get in it and then call an end to the game, then it's ours. Okay, that's the strategy because I can't, um, I can't fight off. And you, medic? Do you want that T? Just get into that tank and then we'll finish. Then we've got two KV ones. Now I'm really miserable. It's right there, direct line from the KV. Where is that mortar? Just drop some mortar shells there. Are you moving? No, you're not. You're not fixed up yet. We getting anywhere with you? Just keep hitting that spot there because that's where we know that gun is. That's it. Right, you're going to get into that and you're going to get that fixed up. Because I think we've just wiped out that artillery piece.
get that fixed up. And somewhere around here, just get to that, just recap that. You're my final man and then we are going to call it. It's kind of ridiculous end to the game, but that's the best we can do. A piece of artillery here, or is it gone? Yeah, well, we can have that, thank you. For all the grief it caused us. And escape and finish, yes. Wow, okay. Well, crazy game. Really crazy game. It was a good fight, but the number of KV-1s, KV-2s. We lost both 85s. We're in some kind of trouble now. That was defence. How are we in a mountain attack? Well, we have got two KV-1s, but we shall see where this goes to. So let's get out of here. Um, what was that thing in the end? Just too much stuff uh, and, and too many call-ins. They're fielding too many points there. 3.8 stars, total gain 1.2 stars, research we've got, okay let's get out of here, okay let's get out, we've got 8.2 stars, what do we spend our research points on? 9, we don't have enough, we don't have enough for the calling, okay. We don't have enough for the calling. eight points we could get as far as pack 40 we can get as far as fat where can we get on the flak line can we get to flak 88 of our own eight points we could get all the way to flak 36 but we're on the attack and with eight points we could get to We can get to Panzer G's. No, we can't. We can get to Panzer 2's. But that's as far as we go. We've got to go for that calling. We've got to go for that calling. That's all we can do. But not now. But not now. Not after that battle. Okay, I'm going to dodge out of here. Let's just take a look at what we got. Phase 1. A mortar survived. A machine gun survived. A truck survived. And a KV-1 survived. In terms of caps... Yes, we got the 122, we got a KV-8 Flame, that's what that vehicle was. Uh, but we're now going to have to sort out what we do for the next game. But I'm going to take it from there. Once more, guys. Whew. That was just exhausting and overwhelming, but we made it through. So once more, thank you for watching. I hope that I'll see you soon, and I certainly hope that I'll see you on the next battle when once more we're attacking on Zitadel. Day 13, Operation 13, but until then, from Gaming Gronyards, it is bye for now.